Garden State Aviation here back with another video. This is the Gemini Jets February 2021 releases, uh, model releases, of course. Um, now, um, I'm filming this on Thursday, February 4th uh, at 6 o'clock in the evening. So the releases are about three hours old, so I'm pretty sure that not many of you have seen it. So, um, yeah, these are the releases, and that being said, without further ado, let's get started. So, first, we're going to start with the 1 to 400 releases. Starting off with the 1 to 400 releases, we have this Aeromexico 77-9 Dreamliner. Uh, this is in the normal livery. The registration is X-Ray Alpha, Alpha Delta Hotel. This is what it looks like. Now, I don't need it for Newark. Um, I don't need it at all. This is something that's going to be popular with those of you who do, obviously, Mexican destinations, European destinations, uh, and just destinations in general where, um, you know, Air Mexico flies to. But yeah, that's an Air Mexico, 787-9. Uh, the registration XA Alpha Alpha Delta Hotel, XA ADH, and the MSRP is $56.95. Moving on down the line, we have this uh, British Airways Airbus A380. This is what it looks like. Looks pretty nice. Um, looks very nice, actually. This is going to be really popular, I have a feeling. Um, because a lot of people, a lot, a lot of people um, want this model. Um, and, of course, Gemini is, of course, fulfilling that demand and making it. Uh, this is what it looks like. Uh, it's just, just a normal uh, livery British Airways A3D aircraft. The registration is Golf X-Ray uh, Lima Echo Delta GXLED. MSRP is $66.95. Moving on online, we have a Cargo Lux 747-400F Raider. Um, now... I've seen Gemini just releasing a lot of Cargo Lux aircraft lately. They've released them in 1 to 200. They've released them uh, a 1 to 400 interactive one last month. Um, and of course, um, this one. This is the Cargo Lux 747. Okay, Cargo Lux 747 400. Um, this is what it looks like. It's in the uh, retro delivery. Looks pretty nice. Um, registration is Lima X Ray, a November Charlie Lima, LX NCL. Uh, and it's $61.95. Now, I don't need a, uh, neither of these, the Cargo Lux or the British Airways. I don't need any of them, uh, as I do have both of them. Uh, I, uh, sorry, I don't have both of them. Uh, I don't need any of them for Newark. They don't fly to Newark. Uh, but yeah. Anyone moving on online, this is going to sell out very fast. Like, extremely fast. This is a Delta 757-300. This is uh, what it looks like. Now, the reason why I have a hunch that this is going to sell out pretty, pretty fast uh, is because um, this has been a wanted model for a long time. I know Delta 757-200s are kind of rare nowadays. They're rare nowadays. Um, so, this is going to sell out pretty fast. It's just a normal Delta delivery aircraft. There's changes to November 586 November Whiskey and 586 NW. Uh, and the price is 48.95. Moving on to the line, we have this LL Israel Boeing 737-900 appears appears to be. Um, it appears to be normal livery, except for the fact that it is in the peace livery. Um, this just looks like a normal LL livery, except with this tiny, tiny thing on the top. I think it's supposed to I mean peace in Hebrew. I think it's supposed to write peace in Hebrew. Uh, yeah, it appears so. It's just a normal 737-800, except with the words peace written on it. Um, registration is for X-Ray Echo Hotel Delta for XEHD. Of course, it is scale 1 to 400, and the price is $46.95. Moving on online, we have yet another Emirates aircraft in uh, Gemini Jets' release. This is the Emirates uh, Airbus A380. This is in the Year of Tolerance livery. Um... So from what it looks like, this does appear to be some sort of livery that's supposed to, you know, tolerate all people, genders, cultures, nations. Uh, and obviously, it's advertising the Expo 2020, even though it's 2021. Uh, that's a little bit weird. Uh, but this is what the aircraft looks like. Registration is Alpha 6 Echo Yankee Bravo or A6EYB. Uh, EVB actually, Alpha 6 Echo Victor Bravo A6 EVB, and it's $66.95. Wow. We're going on the line. This is going to be popular with those of you who are European collectors. Oh, um, by the way, I don't need these aircraft, uh, they don't fly to Newark. Anywho, moving on the line, we have this Interflug, Interflug, Flug, Interflug, uh, Aleutian IL 62M. Um, normal Interflug aircraft, from what I know. 
Uh, yeah, basically, for those of you who don't know, Interflug was uh, basically the East German airline, the national East German airline. Um, Interflug, uh, Flug, Flug, Interflug. Um, they flew out of East Germany. They flew to many Soviet destinations, uh, and uh, you know a lot of destinations in the East. Registration is Delta Delta Romeo Sierra Echo November DDR uh, SEM. That's what the aircraft looks like. Uh, and it is forty seven ninety five. Uh, of course, I don't need this for New York, but I would like Gemini to re-release the um, Czech Airlines IL sixty two M. Uh, I really would want want them to re-release that because um, I'm kind of want to build a small fleet of Czech Airlines aircraft as um, Czech Airlines do have sentimentality to me. They're the airline of my favorite country, so uh, yeah, I really do want them to release the Czech Airlines one CSA, but uh, that's probably not gonna happen. But yeah, this is an Interflug Illusion L62 M. And moving on down the line, we have this. Tui Boeing 737-800. Uh, this is with the split scimitars, 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 scimitars livery. Uh, just split scimitars. Um, normal Tui. Um, registration is Golf Foxshot Delta Zulu uh, uniform. I don't need this for New York, of course, but I know this probably is going to sell out as um, Gemini just don't really make a lot of Tui aircraft. Um, um, Recently, I haven't seen them making a lot of two aircraft, so this is probably going to sell out quite fast. Um, but this is the two E seven three seven eight hundred split scimitars. Uh, I don't need for Newark, of course, two E. Uh, but the registration is Golf Foxtrot Delta Zulu uniform, and it's forty six ninety five. Okay, this one I really need. Um, I always say that I'm going to get models, but I don't because you know I don't have the money. This one I will do whatever I can to get. This is E. A United 77-9 Dreamliner. Um, wow. Uh, I obviously need this for Newark. Um, I'm trying to build up my United fleet, so this I really, really, really need. This is a United 77-9 Dreamliner in the new livery slash blue evolution livery. Um, this I really need this for Newark. United do fly a lot of 789s. They fly the 789 to Tokyo, Rome, um... Tokyo, Rome, Los Angeles, San Francisco, uh, Sao Paulo, Rio de Janeiro, uh, and I believe Frankfurt and London. So this this one I really need. Uh, that's what the livery looks like. Uh, registration is November two four nine seven six, and it is fifty six ninety five. Moving on down the line, we have one Gemini Max release. Um, now I've seen um, Gemini just. Uh, been releasing a lot of Max aircraft lately, and I kind of like that because uh, you know Max aircraft military, you know it's for military collectors. Uh, but yeah, this is a one to four hundred Gemini Max. This is uh, French Air Force. Um, this is just a normal Airbus A four hundred M. République Française. Pardon me if, if I mispronounce it. Uh, but yeah, the registration is Foxtrot Romeo Bravo Alpha November um, F. R B A M and it is forty eight ninety five. Moving on to the uh, one to two hundred Gemini two hundred February twenty twenty one releases, we have this Caribay Carabair, uh huh, Carabair Puerto Rico uh, DC nine. This is what she looks like. Um, this I feel like this is for more retro collectors. Um, as uh, Carabair, I don't think they exist anymore. Um, comment down below if they do, but this is a Care Bear, um, Puerto Rico DC-9 uh, with the words Fiesta Jet on it. As it looks like, registration is November 938 Papa Romeo and 938 PR. Um, and there's no remarks, and the price is eighty three ninety five. Now, of course, um, I don't need any of these aircraft, obviously, because I do not collect any one to 200 aircraft. Um... I want to. I want to start collecting it, but first I need to build up my one to four hundred fleet, beef it up, because right now I only have around seventeen uh, models. Uh, not around. I have seventeen models, so I really just you know want to finish building my one to four hundred and then move on to one to two hundred. Uh, but yeah, moving on down the line, we have this Delta Airbus A two twenty dash three hundred. This is what it looks like. Looks pretty cool. Normal Delta delivery. Registration is November. 302 Delta Uniform and 302 DU. Uh, and the price is 92.95 MSRP. Moving on the line, we have another République Française. Pardon me for my uh, 
for, uh, for my uh, French pronunciation. I have horrible French. Uh, I speak horrible French. Uh, but this is uh, basically a French Army Air Force A330. This is what it looks like. Normal aircraft. Um, it's going to be popular uh, with those of you who, of course, collect one to 200 models uh, and who collect, you know, military models. But, uh, yeah, this is what the aircraft looks like. The registration is Foxtrot Uniform Juliet Charlie Hotel, uh, F-U-J-C-H, and the MSRP is one fifty two ninety five. This is this is this is interesting. I'm interested in this. Um, not because uh, uh, first of all, because it's a Kaleida Air, and I um need to collect Kaleida Air models. I need one Kaleida Air seven four seven four hundred for Stuart. Uh, but this is a Kaleida Air seven four seven dash four hundred, and it does appear to be interactive. Uh, this is interesting because Gemini Jets, for those of you who don't know, do have an interactive line in one to four hundred. Uh, they do have an interactive line in that uh, scale, so I think they're gonna. I think they're also creating an interactive line for the one to two hundreds. It's an interactive with the optional uh, doors open close configuration. Uh, the registration is November seventy eight two Charlie Kilo and seventy eight two CK. And the MRS is two hundred two ninety five. Okay, now pricing is getting a little bit ridiculous. Um, it's it's coming a little bit on the ridiculous scale um, because two hundred dollars. Just let this sink in. That is literally the price of an Apple iPod. You can get an iPod Touch for that price. Or a refurbished iPhone, which is ridiculous. I honestly think Gemini should honestly, you know, just change the price. Lower the price by 20 bucks. But, uh, yeah, sorry for my little rant. But, uh, anywho, moving on online, we have another Kalita Air, except this is this time a Kalita Charters 2727. This is what she looks like. Um, registration is November 726 Charlie Kilo and 726CK. Uh, and the price is $94.95. Moving on online, we have two KLM uh, 737-900s. Both of them are in the, um, same, both of them are in the same livery. Both of them, um, same winglets and all this. Uh, same registration too, which is Papa Hotel Bravo X-Ray Papa B. P H B X B, but the only difference between these two is that one has, yep, mm -hmm. one of them has uh, flap slats down and the other one does not. But yeah, that was the Kalem 737-900. Sorry, I that I said 800 before. Um, 94.95 for the regular one. This is what she looks like. And of course, for the one with the flaps down, it is 98.95. Moving on online, we have two Safa 77700s, again, one with the flap slats extended. Both of these are in the Florida One livery. The registration is November 945 Whiskey November and 945 WN. This is what they look like. Um, both of them have are in the Florida One livery, except one has the flaps down and then one has the flaps up. Uh, yeah, and then moving on online, we have a 2E77800. This is a little bit interesting Gemini they're releasing two of the same aircraft except ones in one to 200 and ones in one to 400 this is the one to 200 version same registration golf fox uh, fox Shot delta zulu uniform gfdzu uh and the price is 94.95 moving on to the last gemini 200 of this release we have this virgin atlantic 787-9 dreamliner this is what it looks like Looks pretty nice. Uh, they did release this in January in 1 to 400. I do know that, so I can see why they're releasing it in uh, 1 to 200. This is what it looks like. The Investigators Golf Victor Zulu India Golf, same one as the 1 to 400 one released last month. Uh, GVZIG, that's what the aircraft looks like. Uh, and the price is $148.95. And yeah, that being said, that does conclude this video. If you guys like the video, please like, subscribe. Uh, and comment down below what you're getting from these releases. Really, the only aircraft that I'm going to get is the United 789, 77-9, uh, that I want to get, should I say. And maybe, um, maybe the Delta 757-300, but I'm still working on, uh, last month's releases, getting money for that. But yeah, once again, thank you for watching today's video, and I'll see you in the next video. As always, goodbye.